unimaginable. But I can't help you unless you open up. Miss Walker. Miss Walker. 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 Fetch! Please, tell me what happened. Okay. My parents called me in when they found that I had powers. I was... dumbstruck. But my brother Brent, he always took care of me. He just grabbed my hand and we ran. Spent a few years living on the streets. Staying out of sight, keeping on the move. We did some shitty things to make money. But that job we pulled before leaving Seattle? Worse than the rest of it combined. Come on, sis. It's just one more job. It's all loaded up. Let's just go. No, this one's the payday. Mm-hmm. How much? Enough to rent a decent place. <sighs> yeah? Yeah. Enough for a short-tailed Burmese cat. Huh? Oh, that's <laughs> low. <laughs> <laughs> it's enough for a fresh start. We could use one. Shit, get out, get out! What? It's the cops. Right, you hide, hide! I'll distract them. No, wait! You do this job, we leave tonight. No one will be able to find us? Y yeah, as soon as... No. No! Do not use your powers! I'm not gonna kill anyone, just... Carry my weight. Fetch! Okay. Hey! You! Come over here. Look at me. Eyes up! Right here. Uh, is this really necessary? Officer Hall! One to process. All right, kid. Over here. Seen a kid with a mohawk on this dock? If I search that boat of yours, am I gonna find him? Wait! You wanna see a trick? Ren always pushed me to keep my power secret. If anyone knew a conduit was in town, there'd be a manhunt. And it happened before. But that night, I wasn't worried. I'd use my powers to get the job done, then the two of us would take off. We'd be miles away before the DUP showed up. These guys just love their job. There's gotta be something around here to duck up. Work. Brent, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. But as soon as you started to glow, the whole city went crazy. This is too dangerous. We need to leave now. The DUP's coming. I thought you wanted a fresh start. And you know I want that cat. Just tell me what the job is so I can do it. Uh, fine, just be fast. It's the penthouse at 3rd and Stone. Break in, grab the red duffel bag. Okay. What's in the bag? You get it? And we're leaving with a literal boatload of cash. <laughs> I like the sound of that. We'll get out of Dodge, bro. You're always one step ahead of me. Just be fast. The thought of you in a DUP prison, I couldn't live with myself. Thank 
Yankee. Charge up. Gonna need it. Okay. Fetch, you okay? Were you in that? What happened? The place was full of Russians dancing around a bomb. Shit. The occurrence. They found him. Found who? My boss. If they knew about the penthouse, then they'll know about our boat. We gotta go now. Fine. Warm up the engine. I'll be right there. I'm sorry about all this. I really wanted to get you that Burmese cat. I know. Next time. Patch, stay away from the boat. The currents are just outside. They got guns. What? I'll be right there. No. You have one of your panic attacks near these guys. They'll freaking take you. I'm keeping it together just fine. I got you. Now hang up and hide, dummy. start to freak out. I'd focus on Brent. He was the only thing that calmed me down. I clung to a good memory. First night in Seattle, we found this overpass and got out of the rain. Ended up reading comics by flashlight until we fell asleep. Later, this guy snuck in and tried to steal what little we had. And I was about to make him pay for it. That night, we established the rules. Rule number one, no powers, no matter what. We might lose some gear, but Brent didn't want us to lose us. I shouldn't have used my powers. It was my body was gone. It was my, I lost it. Those breaks from reality changed me. I'd wake up with new powers. It was like my body decided to fight, but my mind just... 
gave up. You've been very forthcoming, Miss Walker. How about a break? You can show me the skill you acquired from your mental snap. I thought you wanted to get control of your powers. That's what we're here for. I don't know. Last time I used them. We'll start with something simple. I'll be watching your progress from up there. Please don't try anything stupid. stupid. All I do is stupid. No, Miss Walker. You're a survivor. Everyone has a weakness. You just have to look for it. There you go. It's a start, but the world won't wait for you. Sometimes you need to act fast, follow your instincts. Not bad. Not great. But you just started. Perhaps you'd like more relatable targets. Impressive, aren't they? These hard light holograms look and feel real. Now, please kill them. I don't just mindlessly shoot things, okay? Oh, the conduit up here making those holograms, Eugene, he won't mind. What's the point? The point is survival. Not just for you, but for those who can't defend themselves. Go on, protect him. Let's see science explain that one. Nice to see you still have some fight in you. Let's hope your other senses are still as sharp. The clock's ticking. Find and save the hostage. Well done. Now, I've hidden a second hostage somewhere nearby. But this time, you'll have to move quickly to save him or he'll die. Horribly. Wasn't the fastest time I've seen on that test. Let's try something else. Push yourself. How high can you jump? You've proven basic mastery. But are you tenacious, Miss Walker? When presented with a challenge, do you fight your way through? Or hide in a corner? On guard, Miss Walker. Here comes another helpless soul.
We've got another victim coming. They just keep coming, don't they? Another hostage. You wouldn't like to see him die, would you? New hostage looks weak. That was an acceptable performance on the hostage exercise. We keep score, you know. Other conduits' achievements are posted to irritate and inspire you. I'm always open to more training. Perhaps you'd like to surpass them. That'll do for now. Take a seat. I'd like you to resume your explanation of what happened in Seattle. <laughs> 